Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, hi, hello. My name is Nicole Kamalo and I post uh, makeup tutorials as well as plus size try on fashion hauls. So if you like seeing any of those, then you can click on the little red subscribe button down below. And if you want to get notified when I upload a new video, then you can click on the little grey bell next to the subscribe button and that'll send you a email or push notification of when I've uploaded a new video. So, today's video is on this makeup look right here. I absolutely love it. I really wanted to get out of my comfort zone and really like do crazy looks this year. Um, not crazy unwearable, but like different crazy. So, not really that crazy, but I'm definitely trying to push my comfort zone and kind of get more out there and do different looks because I don't want to be um, redundant with my looks so this is the look that I came up with today this is an all essence makeup video by the way if you didn't notice by the title every product that's on my face is a essence makeup product and I love how this turned out so um, I'm gonna start out with a mini haul of things that I have picked up recently from essence and then I'll tell you which ones I used in the tutorial and then you can kind of watch and see from there. Um, I do tell you bits and bits in between the tutorials. So if you want to hear all of that, then stick around till the end. But um, this blue lip, I love it. It's crazy. It's not really wearable. You can totally switch it out with a nude if you want to. But I absolutely love how it looks. So, if you want to see this makeup tutorial slash mini haul, then just keep on watching. Okay, so I picked up a couple of things from Essence over the last week and weekend. And I just wanted to show them to you quickly before I started the makeup tutorial because I do use some of them in the makeup tutorial. So I picked up four of the Metal Shock eyeshadows by Essence. Now, I, I think these have been ar around for a little while now. But I only swatched one like recently, last week sometime I swatched one and I was absolutely blown away. This gold one is my absolute favorite. I'm actually planning on picking up another one. That's how much I love it. Same color. But I also want to get the rest of the colors for this. There's a like a greenish emeraldy one. Um, not really emerald, like a really dark green. And then there's also a silver, I believe. So I definitely, I definitely want to pick up the rest of them. But um... These are the four colors that I got. So uh, this gold one is called Solar Explosion. Um, this pinky one is called Stars and Stories. This, like a rose goldy color. Um, this one is called Star uh, Second Second to Mars. And then this last one, which is the one that I use in the makeup tutorial, it's the one that I have on my eyelids right now. Um, this one is called Galaxy Rocks. I love these they're chunky glittery almost um, except for this one which is a little more pasty like a foiled eyeshadow this one and the gold one um, look like foiled eyeshadows and then these two are just like straight up glitter that's how they look and I absolutely love these I can't wait to use them I'm dying to use this gold one it's so pretty then another thing that I picked up over the weekend was this essence eyeliner pen this is the long lasting one in the color white i've always wanted a white um liquid liner or something like that but i figured this can um do the job for now until i pick up a liquid liner um and i can't wait to use this so last thing that i picked up was um this 
Made to Sparkle Quad Eyeshadow Lip and Cheek Palette. Um, I wasn't going to get this initially because I looked at the colors and I'm like, the, only one of them is going to work for me as a highlighter because I initially thought it was a highlighter palette. And then I swatched it and I just, I couldn't leave it behind. It was so beautiful. So I couldn't leave it behind. I picked it up. Um, this says that you can use it on your eyes, your lips, and your cheeks. So it's, it's really so multi-purposeful. I hope that's the word. Um, so beautiful, you guys. I'm going to show you some swatches really quickly. So pretty. I'm so excited to use the rest of these colors. But in this tutorial, I did use this um, palette. And then on my lips, I didn't really purchase this. Um, I received it. I think last year on my lips is this vibrant shock lipstick from essence um, it's this blue one it's called um, matte 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 vibrant shock number nine beautiful color absolutely beautiful really really well formulated um, it's very consistent which I love but yeah, that's the mini haul of the essence things that I picked up over the weekend and past week. Get into the makeup tutorial. Hey guys, so let's get started. Okay, so I'm going to start with my brows because that's just what I always start with. I'm going to use the essence designer, nope, eyebrow designer in the color number two, brown. It's a very warm toned pencil. So to carve them out, I'm going to use the Essence Cover Stick. This is in the shade Matte Caramel. Okay, so to set them in place, I'm going to use the Essence Make Me Brow. Okay, so now that my brows look somewhat normal, I'm going to go on to the eyes. I'm going to use this Essence Eye Heart Stage Eyeshadow Base. Okay, to set the base in place, I'm going to use the Essence um, Mattifying Compact Powder. This is in the color True Caramel. Okay, so now we're going to do the eyes. Um, I don't have a lot of, like, transition colors from Essence. So for the eyes, um, as a transition color, I'm going to use a compact powder. So this is the Essence Mattifying Compact Powder. But this one is in the color True Mahogany. So it's a, a little darker than my skin tone. And I'm going to blend this into my crease. So I'm going to go in with a Essence eyeshadow. This is in the color Choco Chic. And I'm going to blend that into the crease as well. And I'm extending this product out a little bit just to create a kind of cat eye look. Uh, All About Roses eyeshadow palette by Essence and I'm going to go into this color over here. Okay, so now that we look like we've been beaten up, I'm going to go into this Essence um, Single Eyeshadow. Uh, this is Black as a Berry, number 18. 
and I'm going to use this all over where all that dark stuff is okay I think that's enough darkness for now I'm going to take a makeup wipe and clean up my face Okay, so for the star of the show, which is the lid color, I'm going to use this uh, new Essence Metal Shock eyeshadow. This is in the color Galaxy Rocks. I'm going to carry it above where my natural crease falls. Okay, so while that dries, I'm going to deepen this outer portion over here because I'm trying to go really, really dark with this look because my Lost Essence look was really, really bright and girly. So this one's going to be really dark and I want to say dangerous because it doesn't take a lot to go from dramatic to you look injured, so. Oh, this is the All About Grey's eyeshadow palette by Essence. I'm using the black. Okay, so I'm happy with the eyes, so I think the eyes are done. I'm just going to apply mascara because I know Essence has lashes, but I don't own any. So, let me mascara look. I might change my mind though. Okay, so that's the eyes done for now. I'm going to move on to my face. And I don't have a primer for from Essence, so I'm gonna go straight in with foundation. And I don't know. I think I'm gonna use this. This is the All About Matte Oil Free Makeup. This is in the color. Matte Caramel. That looks really dark and it goes orange. So I'm gonna mix that in with the Stay All Day 16 Hour Long Lasting Makeup. It's in the same color, matte caramel. Heck, they look exactly the same. So I'm gonna use a brush to blend it in. They do have really, really light concealers. They have concealers for fair skin tones. But I think if you're trying to buy foundation from there, and this is like the closest color to your skin tone, just buy a concealer for fair skin. Not too light, obviously, but like the darkest fair skin concealer. And then use that to color correct because... I'm pretty sure it's not gonna match. That's fine. We're gonna fix it. We're going to fix it. We're gonna try and fix it. So I'm using the cover stick. We might be able to fix it. Hello. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm 
We're gonna set our face with the compact powder in true caramel. Okay, so I'm gonna contour my face with this Happy Girls All Pretty Contour Set. It's a very cool toned cover. I'm going to bronze my face with the matte compact powder in the Kello Mahogany. Essence does have really nice contour palettes um, that are out now, so that'll probably be helpful. They also have a banana powder. So that'll probably be helpful when you're using their um, foundations just to kind of brighten because they are extremely dark, at least for me. Okay, we're going to move on to blush. I'm going to use this Essence Matte Touch Blush in the color Bear Me Up. We're going to finish off the eye makeup uh, I'm gonna take this berry color and run it on the bottom here I'm gonna go into the roses palette and use this color and run it at the bottom Just on the outer half. Okay, so we're gonna finish off the eyes now. I'm going to apply mascara. This is the the full flash mascara, extra volume and curl. I'm gonna stick with mascara. Okay, so to finish off our look. Um, before we do lipstick, we're going to highlight, and for that, I want to use this, but I feel like it's going to be really, really, really bright. Okay, so I'm highlighting with the Made to Sparkle Quad Palette by Essence. It says, don't let anyone dull your sparkle. Um, love this, you can use it on your eyes, your cheeks, and your lips. I'm going to be using this yellowy one as my highlighting color today. It's intense, so it's not going to be for everyone, but that's okay. You could totally use an eyeshadow to highlight, or if you have one of their limited edition highlighters, or even this has a highlighter inside very very natural highlighter so this one obviously is for paler skin very subtle like healthy glow you know those people yes that's that highlighter that's not me so we're going intense okay this highlighter is intense Okay, so that's highlighter done. I think that's everything done except for our lips. I don't have the setting spray, but they do make a setting spray. So for this video, I'm not going to use a setting spray. Okay, so for my lips today, I'm going to use this Essence Matte 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 Vibrant Shock Lipstick. It's a blue one. It's a blue lipstick. Mm -hmm. This is how it looks. Really pretty. Love the formula.
so I actually love this crazy I know and this is definitely not for everyone um, but if you want to kind of wear it out you can totally switch it out for a nude but I actually love this is that weird it's blue. I love it are you kidding me this is so cute okay guys so that is the end of this makeup tutorial I forgot to film the outro but that's okay because I have this cool posy section uh, I really hope you guys liked it if you did please give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe check me out on all my social media it will be linked down below as well as at the end of this video and I will see you guys in my next video bye